Everybody in Curtis. I do too. Curtis Baseball 2000 represent. Say goodbye to all my Curtis Warriors softball team, volleyball team, basketball team. I love you guys. Good luck next year. Peace. I love you. I love Curtis. I'm going to miss everyone. I love all of you, especially Diva. Okay. I love you too, Daniel. And I wish everyone luck and I miss you all. Mwah. Hi, Curtis. I love you. I'm going to miss everybody, especially my two friends. This is Rich and I'm with my baby Rosie over here, and we just want to say goodbye to all of y'all. We're going to miss you. Class of 2000, baby. See you in the future. I just want to say what's up to all my peoples out there, and finally, after four years, I'm out. No doubt, all right? Thanks for showing love. And you the Russell Simmons. Thanks for coming out. God bless you. Good night. Yo, peace out, y'all. We're the big dogs. Big dogs right here. Mike Goodman. Christine and Carrie Ann, we want to wish everybody a great graduation and hope they have success in the future. All I have to say is I may have not gotten to know most of you, but just everyone just keep it real and have a good career after high school. Bye. Congratulations, class. 2000. <laughs> what up to the swim team and golf team? Woo! Class of 2000, are you ready to rock? Three DJs on three decks out here on a beautiful night. Chilling with Mike Danza, chilling with all the faculty. Come on, enjoy. Get down there and dance. Hey, congratulations, everybody. Goodbye and good luck. Despite having to drag ourselves out of bed to come to school to get our yearbooks, the breakfast made up for it. It was well worth getting up early for. The books were beautifully designed. The minute people started getting their yearbooks, they ran to their friends anxiously trying to get them signed. No one wanted to get left out, so at times, there were as many as three people at a time signing one's yearbook. Everybody, one love seniors, J33, keeping the real. You know how I do. <laughs> right, class 2000, good luck in the future. I'll miss you all. Hi, I want to say goodbye to all my friends. I'll miss every one of them and not to forget about me, okay? Take care, everybody. Bye. It's like a Bible over here. I want to say thank you for, uh, for everybody, class of 2000 over right here. I want to miss all of you. I'd just like to say congratulations to all the seniors. We made it, and good luck in your future. I just want to say goodbye to all the seniors. I will love all of you, and I'll miss every single one of you. And I'm so glad I got to know almost every senior. I know people's names that I never thought I would know before. I love y'all with all my heart. Y'all became brothers for those who's back in 61 with me. We all chill now. We all be chill forever. I, lo I love y'all, man, and one, I'm out. Good luck to everyone. It's been real. Good luck and much success in the future to everybody. Hi everyone, um, it's been such a great year and a great four years and um, everyone is particularly great in their own way and I'm going to miss you all. Bye. Okay, this is not really the last day of school. I'm going to see you all in graduation, but I want to say good luck to all, pe to all of you and to room 115 and all my people, Lisa, and all the friends that I've been through for the past four years. I'd like to say goodbye to the class of 2000, Curtis High School, all my teachers and my friends. Good luck and much success to everybody. Graduation, you're thinking about everything that's happened in the past four years. I think I'm really going to miss my friends. This is a very special place for all of us here today. And I think many of us in the senior class realize how special it is now that we're graduating. It's first grade. After many long days of dreaming of graduation, the day finally came. On June 27, 2000, at 4.45 p.m., the Curtis High School Class of 2000 began the school's 123rd commencement. Along with the usual pomp and circumstance, the orchestra played their rendition of the Overture of 1812. Christina Leipin, our valedictorian, and Peter Maltobano, our salutatorian, both gave their final thoughts on the past four years, as well as their hopes for the future. Thank you. 
scared about the future. I don't know how to say it, but um. I am scared about the future. For the past four years, with each passing day, we grew closer. Slowly, separate cliques began to merge until we finally came together in mind and in spirit. Our senior year became the one where we were the most tight, and chances are we will not realize it until years from now. We suffered, laughed, and cried together, and now we must go our separate ways, but we'll hold the many memories we had together in our hearts. The class of 2000 is truly leaving behind a legacy that will never be forgotten. Can we make it somehow? I guess I thought that this would never end. And suddenly it's like the women and men. Will the past be a shadow that will follow us round? Will this memory fade when I leave this town? I keep, keep thinking that it's not goodbye. I keep on thinking it's good. Let the word go forth from this time and place that the torch has been passed to a new generation of Americans. <laughs>